everybody. This uh, last part of this section is how to find the area of a regular polygon. And so here I have uh, a hexagon. Remember, a regular polygon, all the sides are the same and all the angles are the same. And in this video, I just want to show you the formula that we use to find it and just some vocabulary for different pieces of this uh, problem. Okay, so first of all, uh, with a regular polygon, find the area. You need to know what a few things are called. The distance from the center, and when I say center, imagine a circle going through these vertices and the center of that circle. The distance from the center perpendicular to a side, that is called an apothem, A-P-O-T-H-E-M. Okay, that's an apothem. The distance from the center to a vertex, for example, from here to here, that's called a radius. And if you're talking about all of them, then it's a then it, then they are radii. Okay, and then the distance around the outside is still called the perimeter. I'm not going to point an arrow at any particular piece of this picture, but that's called the perimeter. And those are the key things to know when you're uh, talking about the area of a regular polygon. A couple other things that are going to figure into our calculations and our ability to solve these questions. And I'm just redrawing my hexagon. When I draw this from the center to a radius and a, and a distance or a radius from the uh, center to a, to a vertice, and then another one, this is called a central angle. Central angle. Oh, and you can't see it in my picture. Central angle. And if I were talking about a, a hexagon per, in particular, if I drew all the central angles for a hexagon, take a look at how many I have. One, two, three, four, five, six. It's the same as the number of sides. And if I want to find the major of those central angles, here's all I do. I take 360 degrees and I divide it by six. If there were five, I would have five central angles and I'd take 360 divided by five. And so that's a key component of being able to solve these questions as well. The formula is this. Area is equal to one half the apothem times the perimeter. And that's the formula that you need to have in your note sheet. And basically what it is, if you notice, it looks very similar to a triangle formula. And what it is is a shortcut to find the area of all the triangles in a regular polygon that are drawn from its central angle. One, two, three, four, five, six. So there'd be six triangles there. So all I have to do is I have to go one half the apothem, which remembers the distance from the center perpendicular to the side, times the perimeter. All these sides added up. So it actually is, in a hexagon, for example, find the area of six triangles and add them all together all in one step. This formula is handy to be able to do that. Thanks for listening.